everyone welcome back to this week's youtube video and in this video we're going to be talking about a new method called facebook marketplace drop shipping so without any further ado let's get jump into it so first you want to go and type up facebook.com slash marketplace and once you've done that you're going to get something similar like this now this is very similar to ebay except there's way more benefits with marketplace so marketplace you actually don't even have to there's no fees so there's no insurgent fees there's no selling fees it's free to obviously list on marketplace and organic traffic as well. So what basically we're going to be doing, we're going to be, I'm going to be showing you a complete beginner guide on how to drop ship on Facebook marketplace as a beginner. So what you want to do, normally people drop ship on here, as you can see, you know, this is just today's picks and, you know, they have categories, you know, stuff for rent, jewelry and accessories. And there's not many drop shippers on here, but there is drop shippers on here. You just got to know where to look. So there's categories on the left hand side here as you can see and normally when you go to pet supplies you do see some drop shippers so i'm going to open this up and you just want to have a scroll through here and you're going to probably see it's like this item that's a drop ship item as you can tell that's a stock image um anything like that it's a stock image normally in pet supplies we do have drop shippers that are you know drop shipping their products around and everything like that um normally yeah it's very easy to spot like that's drop shipped as you can tell and all you have to do is you can just pick a supplier. So we're gonna use Amazon in this example. All you can do to Amazon, you can just go to Amazon best sellers. That's all you're going to need. And then, yeah, you just gotta go ahead and start, you know, basically you can drop ship on to Facebook Marketplace. And yeah, it's very simple. So all you have to do, like I said, once you've found a good product with profit, um, I've gone already ahead and obviously found that product. And I was just do simply looking at research, looking at reviews. As you can see, these ones have a lot of reviews. And so this is going to be the product that we're going with. So all you have to do is very simple. Go onto marketplace, press create new listing, item for sale, vehicle for sale, property for sale, rent, item for sale. Very simple, very straightforward. Now it's very important about your title that you post that has, you know, SEO keywords. So search engine optimization, make sure that you have good keywords in the title. You can't just go like this and just go, yep, thank you, thank you. You can use that, but you're gonna have to, you know, base it off, you know, you're gonna have to get some keywords. So seven pack drain augers, um, man, hair drain clog remover. So drain relief. So there is some keywords in there. Obviously, you want to take out that. Um, stuff like this in brackets. This is relevant. Um, cleaning tools, good. Clog remover, drain relief. So that's all pretty good. And now for the price, obviously, you want to list it for higher than this. So this is 12 bucks, and it's free delivery. So obviously, with Amazon, you have very fast shipping. So that's what you want. Um, and then you could just go ahead and price this. So you can test it at probably $35. And then for the category, you could most likely just do, well, obviously you just go to the category that you selected on here. So we are in home improvement. So you can simply just go to home and garden um, appliances that would do. Condition, new description. For the description, doesn't matter at all. You can just go ahead and copy and paste the description that is already on um, Amazon. So let's just go ahead and do that. And like, why would you want to think of a description, right? If they do it for you, it just makes perfect sense to do that. Also, if the images are on there, even better. Um, let me just get that there. Control C. And now if you paste it in, it should obviously you look up on here, make sure that, you know, that's not too bad. Obviously stuff like, you know, that's repeated, just remove. Um, Cause you still want like the description to be at least, you know, somewhat not just like spamming. Um, so yeah, that's good. Looks good. But like I said, it's very simple. All you have to do is just copy, paste, list in stock brand. Now you can either do your brand, like, like I said, like when you have a store on marketplace, you could do um, like home improvement or whatever, like whatever you had, like say you had a pet brand, you'd put, like call it whatever that name. There's not, you, or you can just leave that blank it's entirely up to you. Juicer type, it's not a juicer. Okay, now product tags, up to you if you want to do that. Obviously, this is going to probably get you more reach. So, again, just looking at the keywords. So, we can just do clog remover, you know, drain relief, clog remover. Um, very simple stuff. 
or you can do cleaning tool. You get the gist. Skew, leave that there. Location, just do your location. Don't need to boost it and hide. And now the last thing that we need to do is add the photo. So with the photos, you can simply go onto here, you know, save image as. Um, normally we click on that. Yeah, so that's the one. Obviously, like um, you already know what to do with images. You go ahead, get all all the images there. Up to you if you want to make a thumbnail. I'm only going to save one of these because I don't want to waste any more of your time. <laughs> um, so yeah, after you uploaded that image and you know that looks clean, obviously you have more. I've just only done one. And then once that's all done, check it out. Thirty five bucks, good title, brand new description's done. Click next. And then, and then marketplace, don't need to do any of the groups because you probably want to keep this discreet um, from other friends and stuff like that. And then press publish. And that is essentially how to drop ship on marketplace. Obviously, you have to ship out the orders once you make a sale. Um, but yeah, you don't need to do anything else. Um, and yeah, once that's done here, you can obviously check out, you know, the views, the clicks on the listings and everything like that. Um, and you can also, you know, mark it out of stock. You can edit the listing, view the listing delete the listing there. So yeah, essentially that's how Facebook Marketplace dropshipping works. It's very simple. Find your product, do your research, make sure the product that you have is very like, you know, has that wow factor, has fast shipping, and then list it on Marketplace, wait for sales. And then obviously once you get a sale, you get their address from Marketplace, go onto Amazon, add to cart, ship it to their address, you keep the profit. And in this case, we would have made $35 minus 12, not going to do the math on that, but that's around $20, $23 profit. Um, but yeah, essentially, guys, that's it for this video. It's very short, very sweet, very simple. And this is a very good business model if you have $0. So you can basically do this with no money up front. And um, yeah, that's going to be it for this week's video, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. And um, drop a like, drop a sub, and I'll see you guys in next week's video. Peace.